Another ransomware attack taking over the world, or at least most of Europe. This time, the culprit is Bad Rabbit. Let's hope it's not as smart as Bugs Bunny. The countries mostly affected by this attack are Russia, Ukraine, and some other Eastern European countries. So maybe this time it's ransomware by Russia for Russia. Oh, I need to stop with these jokes. But here's the sample. As you can see, it claims to be an Adobe Flash Player installer slash uninstaller. And for all of you guys who are still like, oh, but you can always look at a file and decide whether it's ransomware or not. Well, you can't. These days, malware is pretty sophisticated. A regular user probably wouldn't be able to tell that this is not a legitimate file. For example, if you look at the digital signatures, it says it's signed by Symantec Corporation. Now let's talk a little bit about the ransomware and its abilities. This does have the ability to move laterally and infect other systems on your network. It even comes with a hard-coded list of usernames and passwords, so it could be a targeted attack. Most likely the creators of this ransomware are the same ones who made Petya or not Petya. However, it seems Bad Rabbit is much more geared towards making financial benefit than Petya slash not Petya, which was not really a ransomware since there was no way to actually recover your data, and also used a fixed email address, which means they couldn't have had access to it for a very long time. This time, though, all of those things are fixed. It's a Tor page that you get your payment information in. Now let's see what happens when you execute the sample. As you can see, it does seem to require administrator privileges. After that, though, it just disappears. It's very silent does its job in the background, sneaky rabbit. If we take a look at our files, we already don't have access to them. Nope, can't open the file. It seems our data is already encrypted. And after a reboot, this is what you get. Oops, your files have been encrypted. That's a big oops over there. If you see this text, your files are no longer accessible. No shit. You might have been looking for a way to recover your files. Don't waste your time. No one will be able to recover them without our decryption service. We guarantee that you can recover all your files safely. All you need to do is submit the payment and get the decryption password. Visit our web service at this onion domain. So as you can see, this time the cyber criminals are trying to be really nice. Um, they're offering it as a service. Web service. Have to say, it's not very different from some web services provided by some major companies, sadly. It may seem funny now, but trust me, it's not funny when it happens to you and you don't have backups. So back up your data, use proper anti-malware solutions. I can't stress this enough. Most popular vendors detected this ransomware very early, but I don't know why. Like in the midst of all this ransomware chaos, there's always, you know, that one group of people who'll be like, oh, but you don't need antivirus. Antivirus doesn't do anything. Like, no, just stop. Stay this madness. Use proper security. Thank you for watching. This is Leo from the PC Security Channel. Please like the video and share it if you enjoyed it. And as always, stay informed, stay secure.